This is the courtroom where Muhammad was sentenced to death. It's the highest court in Bosaso. Every week, serious criminal cases such as piracy, sexual assault and murder charges are brought here. They are judged according to Somalia's Sharia law. And this is the judge who sentenced Muhammad to death, Sheikh Adam Ahmed. He is a strict disciplinarian. In court today, Ismail Sheikh is on trial for murdering his wife. This judicial concept is called Qisas and Muhammad back on death row is caught in it. He spent the past four years waiting for his victim's family to make up their minds. Qisas in Sharia law means literally equal retaliation and it states that the murder victim's family decide the fate of the murderer. They can carry out the execution or they can choose to pardon him or they can demand blood money. The negotiations can go on for years, but in Muhammad's case, the negotiations are breaking down. I am traveling to a village 100 miles south of Bosaso to meet the man who will eventually determine to free or execute Muhammad. His name is Ali Faras and he is the father of Mahmoud, the man Muhammad shot dead on the boat. He is very much the patriarch of the family. A former military man, Ali Faras trained in Moscow in the 1960s and then retired to take up a more peaceful life as a camel herder. His son Mahmoud was just 21 when he was murdered. He retrieved Mahmoud's body from the seashore. He told me his wife has never recovered from the loss of their son. The process of Qisas is coming to an end. Ali Faras must decide what to do. Yeah, <laughs> I